Well, it's certainly starting to seem that way. Let's begin. Now, can someone please explain to me how, despite her many previous offences, or either driving or otherwise, she, from what I've heard so far, hasn't actually received a prison sentence yet? Yeah, I know she's probably had more fines and suspended sentences than I'm sure one of my ex-girlfriends has had men, but surely her luck has just got to run out at some point, hasn't it? Although, that might not be for a while yet, because the Daily Express is reporting that she has now had a speed and charge dismissed. Which, to be honest, strikes me a bit strange, really, because presumably they must have had at least some sort of actual evidence of her speeding in the first place to charge her for it. Oh, don't worry, she's famous, and um, not at all in my OnlyFans subscriptions. The article also says that Katie Price has had two charges, including one of speed and dismissed, at a management meeting at Crawley Magistrates Court. The two charges were dropped as no evidence was offered. And Katie 44 had been charged with one count of exceeding the 60 mile an hour speed limit on September the 13th, 2021, and then one count of failing to provide information in January this year. So hang on, is this just lazy policing or an oversight or something like that? Because in my opinion, if she did do those things, then she should at least have some sort of sentence for it. Otherwise, what lesson is it actually teaching her? Or deterrent from her doing something like that again? And not only that, but you'd surely cause more damage to someone if you hit them whilst breaking a 60 mile an hour speed limit than you would a 20 mile an hour speed limit, for example. And I don't think a failing to provide information charge should be swept under the carpet either, because if the police ask you for information that they presumably need, and you don't provide it, then you should at least receive some sort of sentence for it. Otherwise, what's to stop her, or indeed anyone else, doing it again and again and again. Well, you'll see what I mean in this video, as in my opinion, she got a bit of a slap on the wrist, which I'm guessing is not what the rest of us would have got. Anyway, subscribe for more, and I'll see you in the next one.